Hello and welcome to a new episode of Review. Today we will take a closer look at a Boeing 767-300 in the current colors of Asiana Airlines. If we start off with the box, we can see here we have the cutout so we can see the aircraft inside. Then here below we have the Asiana branding. Now if we turn the box around on the back side we can see an image of the aircraft. We have the original dimensions and we can see it is a limited edition with only 1000 pieces ever made. And now let us take a closer look at the aircraft itself. And here she is, the Boeing 767-300, as I said, in the current colors of Asiana Airlines. Asiana Airlines is based in South Korea and is one of the two major airlines that fly to international destinations all over the world. The other one is, of course, Korean Air. Now, this box does not only come with the aircraft itself, but it does also come with this piece of cardboard with an apron position printed on, which is pretty nice. And if we take a closer look at the aircraft itself, and as always start with the taste section of the aircraft, we can see here on the vertical stabilizer we have the ASEAN branding, the South Korean flag, then on the fuselage we have the aircraft type specification, the full registration code and the writing of Kumo ASEAN Group, which is the parent company of ASEAN Airlines. Then, if we move from the back of the aircraft all the way to the front of the aircraft, we can see along the fuselage the writing of ASEAN Airlines and the branding. Then we do of course also have the Star Alliance logo as ASEAN Airlines is a member of Star Alliance. And then under that we have the UNICEF branding as ASEAN Airlines is supporting UNICEF. Then a detail that we have almost always, at least on the heavies, the engines very nicely detailed as we can see here. We can see the fan blades, I like that quite a lot. Then if we take a look at the wings, as we can see here on the upper side, quite nicely detailed, including the full registration code. And if we turn the plane around, on the underside we can see again nice details on the underside of the wing, including the full registration code once again. And then last but not least, we do also have the doors to the cargo compartment, a bit difficult to see here due to the livery or the color of the livery, but I promise you they are there. Now the 767 is obviously not a new aircraft, and in most fleets it's on its way out. And to be honest, the 767, in my opinion, is even not a very pretty aircraft. But with a livery like that, even an ugly duckling like the 767 becomes a swan. Is that the right animal? Well, who cares? Even the 767 with that livery becomes a very nicely looking aircraft. And that is what counts. And if you then add the high quality of this aircraft model, the excellent print, well, then it becomes a no-brainer this is a very nice aircraft to have in your collection. And with that, we have reached the end of today's episode. Now, if you have enjoyed, feel free to leave a like, that would be very nice. Or if you're new around here, why not hit subscribe? That would be absolutely awesome. And don't miss out on the next episode of Review, where we will take a closer look at an Airbus A321 in the colors of Again Airlines. Now, with that, I would like to say thank you very much for watching. Hope to see you soon again. I'm checking out, and bye.